In this video, we're going to look at how we can build switching circuits to implement the three Boolean logic gates, y equals a and b, y equals a or b, and y equals not a. As our first example, we have a circuit consisting of a battery, a lamp, and two switches connected in series, such that the bottom of the top switch is connected to the top of the bottom switch. We'll let y represent the statement that the light is on. We'll let a represent the statement that we're pushing the top switch from the left. And we'll let b represent the statement that we're pushing the bottom switch from the left. Current will only flow when both switches are closed. So this circuit represents the logic y equals a and b. The second example is a battery, a lamp, and two switches wired in parallel, um, such that the switch on the left and the right both share a common top and bottom, but they both operate independently. If either switch or both switches are pushed from the left, then the circuit will conduct current and the lamp will turn on. Thus, this circuit implements the Boolean function y equals a or b. In this example, we'll start with a simple circuit that has a battery, a lamp, and a single switch that you need to push to from the left in order to close it. If we let Y represent the statement that the lamp is on, uh, and we let A represent the statement that the switch is pushed from the left, then this circuit simply represents the Boolean expression Y equals A. Now, if we take the switch and we cut the circuit, And if we take the switch and flip it around, and then reconnect it back in, we'll close it. We see now that the uh, circuit is normally conducting, and we have to push the switch from the left in order to open it. So this circuit implements the Boolean logic function y equals not a, meaning that the light is on if we're not pushing the switch from the left. 